Porto in 3 Days Top Attractions. See Top Attractions of Porto in 3 Days including Church of São Francisco, Palacio de Bolsa, Church of Mercy and Clarigos Tower. You'll see the Portuguese Center of Photography, Lavraria Lelo and Carmo Church. Visit Sores dos Reis National Museum, Saraves Art Museum, Jardim do Palacio de Cristal and Parque da Cidade do Porto. This itinerary includes Cais da Ribeira, Dom Luis Bridge, Funicular dos Guinde and Porto Cathedral. Pop into the Church of Santa Clara, Chapel of Souls and stroll down the Avenida dos Aliados. Day 1 starting from Church of São Francisco through the Palacio de Bolsa and ending at the Carmo Church. Start time. 10 o'clock Church of São Francisco duration, 1 hour. Agrija de São Francisco is Porto's most famous church. The Gothic-style church has interior Baroque decoration although its exterior is Gothic-style with a rose window. The interior is lavishly decorated with more than 350 kilometers of gold covering intricately carved wood. Please like and subscribe my channel. 0.1 km, 1 minute walking start time, 11 o'clock Palacio de Bolsa duration, 1 hour and 30 minutes. This national monument is a neoclassical building which dates back to 1842 and was designed by Joaquim da Costa Lima Jr. It is the headquarters of the Commercial Association of Porto and a cultural conference center. Zero point three km, four minutes walking start time, twelve thirty five Church of Mercy and Museum duration, one hour. This is a beautiful 14th century church with two side chapels which were added in the 16th century and again rebuilt in 1748 by Nicolao Nazoni. 0.3 km, 5 minutes walking start time, 13, 40 portuguese center of photography duration, 1 hour. The museum is housed in a building which dates back to 1767 and was designed by Pombolin Eugenio dos Santos and Carvalho. It functioned as Cadea da Relação, a prison until 1974 and the end of the Salazar dictatorship. The museum holds a permanent collection of 60 different collections including the National Collection of Photography, Municipal Collection and a collection of historic cameras and photographic equipment. 0.2 km, 2 minutes walking start time, 1440 CLERIGOS tower duration, 1 hour and 30 minutes. The tower soars 75.6 meters in the air and offers 360 degrees views across the city. At the time of completion it was the tallest structure in Portugal. Zero point three km, three minutes walking start time, sixteen fifteen Lavraria Lelo bookshop duration, one hour. Visitors come to this iconic bookstore for the books and also to see the gorgeous building. The store building was designed by Francisco Xavier in the neo-Gothic style. It is considered one of the most beautiful bookstores in the world. 0.1 km, 1 minute walking start time, 1715 Carmo Church duration, 1 hour. From the outside the church appears to be one large structure but it is in fact two churches connected by a very narrow house, just one meter wide. On the left is the Carmelitas Church and Bell Tower which dates back to the 17th century and was part of a convent. 2 starting from Sores dos Reis National Museum through the Jardim do Palacio de Cristal and ending at the Parque da Cidade do Porto. Start time, 10. OO, Sores, dos Reis, National Museum duration, 1 hour and 30 minutes. This museum is housed in the historic Carrancas Palace. It was founded in 1833 and displays Portuguese art with a focus on the work of Antonio Sores dos Reis. The museum started off in St. Anthony Convent where a collection of religious art and artifacts were on show. 0.4 km, 4 minutes walking start time, 11.35 Jardim du Palacio de Cristal duration, 1 hour and 30 minutes. The gardens of the Crystal Palace in Porto were on a cliff west of the historical city center. The park was designed in 1860 by landscape artist Emile David to complement the Crystal Palace. The gardens feature sports facilities, a modern multimedia library, auditorium, cafeteria, the Romantic Museum and tree-lined paths with views of the river. 3.9 km, 10 minutes by car start time, 
1315 Serral Vase Art Museum Duration, 1 hour and 30 minutes. This museum displays both Portuguese and international contemporary art in a purpose-built minimalist building designed by Pritzker Prize winner Alvaro Siza. There are 14 exhibition galleries spread over three floors. While here check out the magnificent gardens which surround the museum and nearby Casa de Serraves, an art deco structure from 1925 where more art is displayed. In the grounds you can see the famous oversized shovel by Claes Oldenburg and Kusha van Bruggen as well as other works of public art. The gardens are an important and integral part of the museum. Spread across 18 hectares the gardens feature formal elements as well as natural farm, lands, fountains, ponds, lawns and foliage. 2.9 km. 11 minutes by car start time. 1455 Park DACIDADE du Porto duration, 1 hour and 30 minutes. It is one of very few urban parks in the world with a sea view and there is direct access to the Praia Internacional Beach. The park was designed by Sidonio Pardal and inspired by New York's Central Park. The park covers 80 hectares and is bordered by Avenida da Boa Vista, Circunvalisao and the sea. It is the largest park in Portugal. Please like and share and subscribe my channel. Day 3 starting from Church of Santa Clara through the Cais da Ribeira and ending at the Chapel of Souls. Start time. 9.30 Church of Santa Clara duration, 1 hour. The Igreja de Santa Clara is truly a masterpiece in Rococo and Baroque architecture and decoration. The facade may seem plain but in the 17th century the interior of this 15th century church was transformed into a beautiful work of art with intricate woodwork, gilding and stonework. Zero point two KM, two minutes walking start time, ten thirty Porto Cathedral duration, one hour. Se do Porto is a fortress like cathedral where Prince Henry the Navigator was baptized and King John I and Princess Philippa of Lancaster wed in the fourteenth century. The building was constructed in the twelfth century. It is located in Porto's oldest neighborhood, Moro da Se. Zero point five KM, seven minutes walking start time. 11.35 Kais da Ribeira duration, 2 hours. This Porto area is considered one of the most beautiful places in the world it is also one of the best places to get views across the city. Ribeira means riverside and Kais da Ribeira is basically the district on the banks of the Douro River and running up into the heart of historic Porto's UNESCO World Heritage Site. 0.2 km, 4 minutes walking start time, 13.40 Dom Luis Bridge duration, 45 minutes. The Ponto de Dom Luis is an iconic bridge in Porto which was completed in 1886. At the time it was the longest iron arch in the world. The bridge has two parallel straight tracks separated by an elegant iron arch. On the upper level there is a metro line and on the lower level there are car lanes and pedestrian paths. The bridge is 395 meters long, 44.6 meters high and 8 meters wide. The bridge crosses the Douro River connecting Porto's city center on the north bank with Vila Nova de Gaia on the opposite bank. 0.1 km, 2 minutes walking start time, 1425 Funicular dos Guindeas duration, 45 minutes. The funicular line was constructed in 1891 and is still used by locals to get around the city and by tourists for the brilliant views. The funicular connects the Batala by Cais de Gaia to the Ribeira area at the base of Dom Luis Bridge. The funicular is a single track system which travels 281 meters and descends 61 meters. Although the upper 90 meters of the funicular line are within a tunnel travelers can get great views during the other section of the journey and during the last few minutes when the car emerges from the tunnel. 0.8 km, 13 minutes walking start time, 1525 Sao Bento train station duration, 45 minutes. Catching a train is not the only reason to visit this station. It is not only a major gateway to city but also a tourist attraction. The station was constructed on the site of a former convent, Convent of São Bento de Ave Maria. Porto architect José Marcos da Silva designed the station in the French Beaux-Arts style. The main design features of the station are the paneled tile murals by Azulejo painter Jorge Calaco.
0.4 km, 5 minutes walking start time, 1615 Avenida dos Aliados duration, 1 hour. This avenue is located in the lower city of Porto and runs from the town hall down to Liberation Square. The street name is in honor of the Allies who fought in World War II although the street was originally opened in 1916. This is one of Porto's most beautiful streets, it is lined with Beaux Art buildings including the beautiful Camara Municipal or Town Hall. 0.6 km, 7 minutes walking start time, 1720 Chapel of Souls duration, 30 minutes. The Chapel of Souls is one of the most unusual and beautiful buildings in Porto. It is sometimes referred to as the Chapel of Santa Catarina. What makes this building so special is that all the external walls are covered with blue and white ceramic tiles.